Hey traders, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use the AutoView Chrome browser plugin to automatically manage your trading positions and set your stop loss to break even when a certain price is hit. So obviously the most valuable thing about AutoView and the most useful application of it is to automate your trading scripts. So automating the trade execution and management of your strategy scripts and indicator scripts is the main advantage of this plugin. But one other advantage of AutoView is that you can use it to automatically manage your manual trading positions. So for example, let's say we enter long here on Aussie dollar and we have our stop loss below this swing low in here and we are expecting price to move up. But let's say that after we enter this position, we want to go out for lunch with our girlfriend or boyfriend or partner, or husband, wife, whatever. And we don't want to have to sit and babysit this trade, but we also want to move our stop loss to break even when price action hits a certain price level. Well, of course you could just set an alert here. You could just set a regular alert to pop up on your phone, push notification, and you can manage the position manually. But let's say this is a really important occasion and you don't wanna be checking your phone while you're out, or even let's say you're at a business meeting or something. Well, you can use AutoView to automatically move your stop loss to break even when your price target is hit. So let's say at one to one, when price action gets back up to these highs, we wanna move our stop loss from down here to the price where our trade was entered. Well, I'll show you how to do that now. First thing I'm going to do is create a new order. I'm going to go long at market. There we go. So we have filled at 76012. I'm going to put my stop loss at 75971. 75971. There we go. And I want my stop loss to be moved to break even if price action comes back up to these highs. Well, the way I can do that with auto view is if I set an alert at 76057. So if I just put a horizontal line there, I can right click that line and create an alert on this line. If we come down to the message section, what we need to do here in order to initiate a break even stop alert is first we need to clear our stop loss and then replace it with a new stop loss. So the OANDA API does not allow you to update your stop loss as far as I can tell, at least not through auto view. I haven't found a way to be able to just update my stop loss with a command. What you need to do instead is delete your limit order, your stop loss order, and replace it with a new stop loss order. So the way we do that is we need to reference our exchange again. So Oanda practice. We need to reference our symbol. So I'm on Australian US dollar. And I need to use the C, which stands for cancel or close. And I need to set C equals to order. So this will cancel any limit orders I have. Now keep in mind, this will also cancel your take profit. So if I put a, let me copy this order really quickly and let's put a take profit on this trade up at these highs here. Let's call it 7612, 7612, modify this position. So now we have a take profit up at 7612. Let's create a new alert really quickly. Uh, I'll set the condition to less than just for demonstration purposes. Let's paste that command in here. If I create this alert, when this alert gets triggered, it will delete our stop loss and our take profit. So watch this, let's click create and wait for that uh, alert to trigger. There we go. Now our stop loss and our take profit are gone. We can now use another alert to update our stop loss and take profit. So the way we do this, the way we update our orders is I need to change C to position. So this will now update our position if we give new parameters for our stop loss and take profit. So we need to first set the book. So we are long on this position. So if I set B equals long, I can now set uh, a new fixed stop loss. So in the case of a break even trade, we would set our FSL to 76012. But for now, I'm just gonna replace the stop loss that we just removed. So let's type in 0 0.75. 971 and I will also replace our fixed take profit up here at uh, let's change it to 76092 0 0.76092 now if I create this alert these command parameters will replace our fixed stop loss and our fixed take profit but this is how you would 
move your stop loss to break even or even create a manual trailing stop. But let's wait for this alert to be triggered. There we go, our stop loss is back where we wanted it. I'm not sure what happened to our take profit. Not sure why the take profit was not replaced. Let me just quickly check the auto view logs. Not sure why my take profit is not being placed. Let me play around with this for a minute. Uh, that seemed to work. So uh, I guess we need to use two commands here. One for our stop loss, one for our take profit. So let me change FSL to 0 0.5971. Let me save that, delete our orders again, wait for that alert to be triggered and see if this works. There we go. So we need to separate our FSL and FTP commands. If I copy this command over here and paste it in, now this is where I should mention that we can execute multiple orders in the single alert message. So we can have multiple commands here. And what these three commands will do is the first command will delete our stop loss and our take profit. The second command will set our stop loss to whichever price we want to. So in this example, we're going to set this to break even when this blue line is hit. And then we need to replace our take profit as well. So three different commands here to manage our position automatically. Let's copy this command and delete this alert and add that command to this blue line here. Uh, we need to change our stop loss to our entry price. So FSL will now become 76012. And if I create this alert, if price action gets up to this blue line and triggers this alert, auto view will delete our stop loss and our take profit. It will move our stop loss to break even to the price that we entered at, and it will replace our take profit back at 761. And this will all be done automatically without us having to lift a finger. So long as you have auto view running in your browser, this position will be automatically managed. So this is a great way to use auto view in your manual trading process. Now there have been many occasions in my career as a trader over the past four years or so, where I've wanted to move my stop loss to break even if a certain price is hit, but I end up going to bed and overnight at like three in the morning, price action comes up, hits where I wanted to move my stop loss to break even, but I was asleep and I couldn't manage the position and then price action has come back down to stop me out for a loss on a trade that I should have been stopped out for break even on, but I wasn't able to manage my position. Now I can use auto view to automatically manage my trades while I'm not at the computer. So not only can I fully automate my trading scripts, I can also fully automate my trade management, even on the strategies that I do not fully automate, which is phenomenal and a really powerful aspect of auto view that even manual click traders can take advantage of. So now I'm going to leave my screen capture recording for the next, I don't know, hour or so. And hopefully with any luck, price action will come up and hit this blue line and my trade will manage, auto view will auto manage this trade, will automatically move my stop loss to break even. And uh, with any luck, we can see this in practice. So let's wait and see what happens and I will be back in one second. And no luck on that trade. We just got stopped out by the spread. And yet again, we are stopped out. I'm gonna keep trying until we get a trade that plays out and demonstrates this break even technique. Set our take profit to 7608. Save the alert. I'll put on my profit tool again so we can watch this play out in real time and we'll see what happens. Here we go and success. So our stop loss has now been moved to break even after price has finally come up to test this blue line. And you have no idea how boring it was sitting here waiting for that to happen. And while recording this, I actually just made a cheeky 2% gain on my main account, taking a uh, discretionary trade uh, because I noticed that the one minute chart was holding this, this area down here. And so I jumped over to my main account um, on my second monitor while I was recording and threw on a trade. 1% risk, stop loss below the uh, swing low of this bat pattern and hit targets within an hour or so. It's a nice little profitable video to record. Can't complain about that. And our take profit has been put up here at 7608. So if I scroll up and open up the command that did all this. First, we cleared our limit orders 
on this instrument. Then we replaced our fixed stop loss price to our break even price. And then we added back our take profit limit order. All done automatically using the auto view plugin, which is really cool stuff. Now I can delete this line and that's it for the break even demonstration. So if you were to do this on a real account, all you would need to do is get rid of practice. Make sure that you've connected your real account uh, ID to auto view and make sure you have set all of your exchange parameters to OANDA. And apart from that, none of these parameters need to be changed. Except if you're obviously using this on a different market, you would need to change your symbol to the relevant market. But that's it for today's short lesson. Hope you found that interesting. Good luck with your trading and I'll see you in the next video.